I was lucky enough to be allowed into a uh, kitchen uh, of uh, an extraordinary, uh, delicious uh, food tradition uh, in, uh, in a yado in Kyushu, in the volcanic mountains of Kyushu, next to Beppo in Ukraine. And that was for me the initiation really to um, sort of that, that high and deep culture of cooking and uh, yeah, and uh, I basically uh, started there, but then um, about 10 years or maybe eight years ago or so, uh, when I came back to Japan regularly again, I um, studied under various uh, master chefs here in Kyoto. And shojin became to me uh, especially interesting because uh, it's just so delicious. But also, uh, I do think uh, that it's uh, to a large part really the foundation of all Japanese food uh, traditions in, in many uh, ways, more directly or indirectly uh, depending. But um, I think the thinking process and the uh, philosophical foundations behind um, is, is in all, for all Bashoku traditions uh, very much related to, to Shoujin, I think. So that's what made it so interesting to me. But um, initially, really, it was the deliciousy of the food which hooked me. And that's still the case. And uh, yeah, and uh, luckily, Mitsu is also very much into um, food and eating, enjoys it very mm -hmm. much. Yeah. Uh, and in, in that way also is a great inspiration, really, uh, for me at a reason <laughs> to cook every day. Mm -hmm. um, because, uh, you know, enjoying food together is uh, is a big part of how, how delic delicate it is or it tastes.